sewers and welcome to Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to be talking to you about pocket symbols on your sewing patterns. The first pocket symbol we're going to be looking at is for the single welt, double welt or sometimes called the jetted pocket. Now the only way you can distinguish whether or not it's going to be either one of those is your sewing pattern instructions but this symbol here is telling you that this is going to be the placement for the shape of the pocket and these are also indicating to you these are the matching points for the pocket. The triangular shape here is also a great indication for that type of pocket. On this sewing pattern there isn't a symbol as such for an inseam pocket but it is indicating to me along the edge of the pattern that there needs to be some kind of matching up with these circles. So uh, this is what an inseam pocket would look like similar to this and on the pocket piece itself you've got the circles that need to be matched up and you've also got a notch so that will be a case of just matching up your circle with your notch and it's now in place ready for an inseam pocket. Here is a sewing pattern with a patch pocket symbol and as you can see we have a shape of a pocket with rounded corners, it can be square corners also and this is indicating to me the placement for the pocket and also the top here is also showing where there could be a flap to the pocket so these are the symbols to look for when it is a patch pocket. Here is another sewing pattern that's indicating there needs to be a placement for a patch pocket. Now this line here with a circle at each end is telling me this is a placement for a patch pocket. It should be a straight line but because there's a dart in here it seems a little bit disjointed but that's another indication telling you you need to place a patch pocket here. And finally we have the hip pocket. Now there isn't a symbol as such for a hip pocket which is very similar to the inseam pocket where we have to match the notch and then you have the circles here indicating a seam matching points. Now here is the pocket and um, I'll just turn it over so you'd be matching up the notch and then also the circles for each size. It can be a little bit daunting to figure out all these symbols you find on sewing patterns. The best thing to do is to look through your sewing pattern instructions and then keep in mind what to look for when it comes to the symbols I've shown you. They can be different from one brand to another. Don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Sewing Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials and if you have any comments or queries please put them in the comment box and I will see you next time.